SoCal News Mornings. A fire races through an apartment building in North Hollywood. We have details on this breaking news overnight, including injuries. Plus, new information about the man accused of stabbing a worker to death inside a Lake Elsinore Walmart. Investigators say the victim was a woman he didn't even know. And the Harrison Walls Democratic ticket prepare to swing through the Southwest. We'll tell you what's next for their battleground state blitz and how their GOP counterparts are challenging them along the way. Good morning. Happy Thursday. It's August 8th. Welcome to KCAL News. We're also streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. I'm Kalina Estrinos. Amber Lee is here with a look at your next weather forecast. And we're so close to the weekend. So close to the weekend. <laughs> and the weather is actually cooperating. We're, we're a little cooler. What did you think? I was grateful for you this morning. When I walked on in, usually it's really hot. This yeah. morning I said, ooh, there's a nice breeze. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Last night was beautiful, too. A lot of people yep. were out. So, so yeah, loving it. The cooling trend continues. So Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're our hero. Just the messenger. Uh, but yeah, we're looking at the low clouds and fog returning for some of our beach communities. So a little bit more patchy. We could see dense fog, kind of like what we saw yesterday. And you can also see it here in the background with our downtown LA sky cam that we do have a little bit more of the patchy conditions this morning. Temperature wise, it is a little cooler. So here's a look at our now and later forecast, upper 60s. And then as we head into the afternoon, we're actually getting closer to normal, especially for this time of year. So temperatures will top out in the mid 80s for LA and Orange County. Here's a look at the wind. So we have some breezy conditions that we're watching as we head toward the second half of the day as those winds are going to continue to increase a little bit more of that sea breeze fashion before they flip to more of an offshore fashion this weekend. But notice that our highs, we are still dealing with more of the 90s versus triple digits. So we're definitely cooling down even more. I'll have more details on that slight warm up as we head toward the weekend. Back to you. All right, Amber, thank you so much. We do have some breaking news we're starting off with right now in North Hollywood. That's where flames